Hey, hey, corn friends. I have here an idea of something you could do at home, and that is make a paper that has different parts to it. And in each part, you can put a kind of bird that you are seeing when you look out your window or maybe when you take a walk and you can keep track of the birds that you are seeing in this kind of chart. Now I have started to put some birds in here. These are birds that I have seen looking out of my window. Here I have cardinal and I chose to write it in red because it is a red bird. There's the male cardinal and blue jay and robin. Now I copied pictures from a book, but you could go online and get a real photograph picture of what that bird looks like and put it here, or you could draw the picture yourself. You can sound out the words of the birds you're writing, or you can have a grown up help you write them and spell them. I thought I would add crow to this chart and maybe draw a picture of a crow this time to see how it could be done. So I took a piece of paper and I drew these lines with a ruler. I made it into these sections and you can make as many sections as you want to put birds. Uh, all right, crow, k k k k k c k r r k r o o and I know that there is a w at the end. It's giving all its power to the o so it will say its name. And I know crows are black. So I'm going to draw space for the eye and I'm going to draw a body. <laughs> I'm going to draw a wing. And what color is a crow's beak? I'm not really sure. I'm going to say it's this color. There's a beak. No, I think crow's beaks are black. Actually, if I'm remembering correctly. And then I could color it in, make my crow all black. Uh-huh, there we go. It's gonna have, crows have tail feathers and feet. And there is a picture of a crow that I drew. There's another wing. There, crow. <laughs> now, how would this work? Oh, wait, I have a space up here for a title. What could I call this? I could call it Birds I See, Birds Out My Window. Lots of different names. You could decide what you want to call yours. I'm going to write Birds, Bird, and there's more than one, so I'm putting an S. Birds I See. Birds I See. You can call it whatever you want. And then you can put more birds that you might see, a chickadee or a sparrow, or I don't know what you're seeing, and draw pictures of them or put pictures. Now, how would this work? <coughs> I would put this chart up someplace in my house near where I would see birds. So maybe near a window, or maybe you have a bird feeder at, nearby out of your one of your windows, put it near there. Or maybe you want to make, <coughs> excuse me, this chart small enough that you could put it on a clipboard and take it outside with you when you're on a walk. And then when you saw something, like if I, this morning I was at my, looking out my window where there's a bird feeder and I saw a cardinal. So I could make a mark, a tally mark. Boop, I saw a cardinal. And then when I saw another one, boop, I put another mark. And the way the tally marks work is they work in bundles of five. So let's say I saw five cardinals. One, two, three, four, and then the fifth one, I would go across to make a tally mark and I would know that that's five. And then when I saw another one, I'd go boop. And then I see a robin, and then I see a blue jay, and then I see another robin, and then I see a crow, and then I see another cardinal, and then I see a blue jay, and I make marks. You also might wanna make dots or check marks or any way that you want to keep track of all the birds that you are seeing. That might be fun to do, if you want to. Bye.